Hi everyone, I'm gonna cover a few topics to add shapes to your iMovie, so please check out below for the exact times of what you need to learn. In the display, you can see that I have inserted a white arrow to my video, and that's what we're gonna go over, how to add this. I already took this screenshot with Command Shift 4, and I'm gonna click this little marker to open up this toolbar. I wanna select every part of this image and actually delete it. So I do that and then I click the shape tool and select whichever shape I want. Uh, you can change the weight, the color, what the fill is. Even if you add text, you can add more features to that too. When I do like a box or something around an object, I always use a no fill option. When your shape is the way you want it to be, you can just go ahead and close and it will save for you. Adding your shape to iMovie is ridiculously easy. All you need to do is grab it from where you have it saved and drag it, drop it right in iMovie. Boom, might as well apply for that video editor job with Michael Bay. So iMovie does this real bitch ass thing where they decide the properties for you. If you can see the screen, the arrow was expanding and zooming in. I don't want that and I don't know why they choose it. To fix this, all you need to do is make sure you have the image selected on the sequence and then click the crop button. It's automatically set to Ken Burns. I don't know why the hell uh, or who Ken Burns is, but I'm gonna go ahead and select fit. Then I'm gonna want to click this display option and select picture in picture. So that way it's actually proportionate and in the image. You can go ahead and change the size. I haven't found a way to rotate these, but that's why you just need to put it in the right direction when you make it. When I go back and play over this, it will be flat to show and then I can adjust the length of time it displays in here for however long I want. That's it. Please like and subscribe.